Carolina Rippers back with another video for you. Um, today we have a brand new retail product. These things just kind of popped up all of a sudden and got shipped out quickly. So we have some Contenders Blasters. Contenders uh, should be coming out early July. Right now is the schedule for them. Um, Contenders is one of the one of the most popular products in football cards. Um, probably in, in basketball as well, I'd say. Um, but in basketball, a couple of years ago, they really changed around how Contenders works. They didn't bring that to football. But from some of the inside information that some of the, some of the other guys that do rips and breaks um, have gotten on this stuff, uh, it looks like they may have revamped Contenders in the hobby version to be similar to basketball, which would be awesome. So I can't wait to see that. I haven't really seen the details on it yet. I need to, I need to try to check that out if I can find it. But the other thing about the retail is the blasters for this stuff. Honestly, in years past, this is one of the worst blasters you could buy. Value-wise, there's just nothing in them, uh, except for some very, very rare hits. These, they really have just been awful. So one autograph or mem, like I say, I hate saying stuff like that. Y'all know, y'all know, I'm gonna be honest with you, but. They've been terrible because it usually is 40 uh, paper cards. Um, you usually get a mem card in here that's not associated. It's not numbered. Um, if you can clear me up there a little bit, Carl. Uh, and, and not a lot of numbered stuff. I mean, you, you're just getting a bunch of paper cards with a couple of very vague parallels. So, But what you can get in here is, if I can find it in here, Let's see. Rookie variation opening ticket, opening kickoff ticket, license to dominate, permit to dominate, superstars, die cuts, crown jewels, draft class contenders. You can get numbered stuff. You see this down to 199. Uh, rookie ticket dual swatches. Rookie ticket dual swatches prime to 25. So you can get some lower number stuff, but look at this one. Rookie ticket swatch variation autographs. That is an RPA, folks. They're very rare. They have had those for years, but that that was really all you were chasing. And and they really don't advertise that much with contenders that you can get RPAs out of the retail. They really don't. Um, but if you guys want to go back in our history and our videos here on YouTube, go back and watch our rip of 2021 and you can see us hit uh, a very nice RPA out of one of these. So yeah, go check that out. We'll, we'll, uh, we'll link that video onto this one so you guys can uh, can check that out from here. But we're going to rip some of these and we're going to see. Now, one thing I have already seen that they improved, Contenders normally does not have any base rookie cards. They just have inserts. But this year, we have base rookies, y'all. So let's see. We're going to rip two of them for you. I don't want to go any further than two uh, right now until I know better. I The one that I did see uh, rip... Oh, man. This new wrapping that they use is so thick. The one I did see had some nice base rookies... Um, they did get some numbered stuff. I think they got an auto in one of theirs, too. So I don't know how frequent the autos are going to be in here. But, uh, yeah, let's see what we get. Now, Mega Boxes, I also have seen advertised. Those are going to be one auto and two mems, just like they used to be. So Megas for this product uh, really are where the, the goodies are in the retail side. And it sounds like that might be where it is again. So here's the design. To me, it, it looks very very um contenders but then the little blockiness down here gives me a little bit of a, a playbook feel to it which they didn't do playbook this year looks like they kind of comboed it what do you think yeah i can't see it yeah so all right so deandre swift justin fields oh the, I, and i remember this too it's gonna annoy me cooper cup i don't know why they started doing this james connor every card flips over jonathan taylor cd lamb mac jones and here is your uh, round numbers. you got to be careful looking for those rookies because they hide them in the middle. Ja'Korian Bennett and Aiden O'Connell, both for the Raiders. Round numbers looks different this year. You notice that? They didn't give, like, the big white space for autographs. Mm. So I wonder if they do. I'm, assume, I'm assuming they do the dual auto. I guess they just stick the auto on top of the picture. TJ Watt, Gasicki, Stefan Diggs, Devontae Adams, Mike Evans... Aaron Jones, there's one of our parallels. Micah Parsons, it is a red, if you can see the, the red uh, foil over here. And CJ Stroud, Rookie Stallions. Well, we hit a nice insert. I really like this one. What do you think of that, Cole? I like the design of that. Yeah? Yeah. I like the design of that a lot. So we did hit a CJ. First box, we take the CJs. 
All right. Not bad. Happy with that. DeAndre Hopkins, Christian Watson, Devontae Smith, Jamar Chase. And this is why this is, honestly, this product is so bad. It's just a giant box of base cards. Matt Stafford, Kyler Murray, Michael Pittman. Draft class, David Carr. Old school draft class. Like, okay, interesting. This is something I think they pulled up from contenders draft picks that they stopped doing that set a few years ago. Uh, and they kind of pulled that into here, I guess. Not a bad insert set, but Desmond Ritter, when that's all you're getting, it's a little depressing. Shaq Leonard, Brock Purdy, Dak Prescott, Von Miller, Jimmy G. This one's a little bit out of uh, place, but Quentin Johnston draft class. And then we got a Deion Sanders red draft class. Maybe it's because we have the parallel. A little color match with the Falcons. That's pretty neat. Neat card. And then our last pack in box number one. Looks like a mem card. Jaco uh, Josh Jacobs. I said Jacorian Bennett. What the heck? Derrick Henry. Jair Alexander. We did not get a rookie, a base rookie in here. Reddick and Burrow. At least not yet. All right, so that's our mem. Jaden Waddle. DTR is going to be our mem. And on the back, another one. This is a nice one. Quentin Johnston, Jordan Addison. Not a bad not a bad card to get. My, but look at this, y'all. Oh, my gosh, Panini. Come on, man. Look at the centering on that. Look at this, Cole. You seeing this? That's pathetic, man. That's not even 90-10. That's like 97-3. What is that? That's that's just depressing. All right. So a big box of nothing, and then the one card that was a little bit decent other than the CJ Stroud is, is off-center like crazy. Come on, Panini. What are you doing to us, guys? And so first box, got to be honest, not, not giving me good vibes. Not giving me good vibes. All right, box number two. Let's see if this one's better. And we did not get um, any base rookies. So it's kind of funny because I, I saw um, I saw a box opening of this stuff. I'm just going to look through real quick, make sure I didn't miss anything. You guys will tell me if I missed one. Yeah, there's none. But I did watch somebody else open one, and he got like three or four in one box. And then the other ones got none. So it's, it's very strange. All right, that's okay. got some interesting stuff there. A little red in the back. Looks like Panthers colors. That'd be nice. Aaron Jones again. DeAndre Swift. Justin Fields. That's the way the other box started. Cooper Cup. James Conner. Jonathan Taylor. We got another one of these. Luke Schoonmaker. Rookie Stallions. I do like that. Oh, this is a nice one on the back. Bryce Young. Draft Class Red. All right. That's not bad at all. That one feels a little glossy too. I wonder if the other ones were glossy. I have to go back and go back and check. Now that one is centered pretty well. Um, what is that? <laughs> Cole had something in the middle of the screen. <laughs> I couldn't see the cards. I like that. What do you think of that one, Cole? A little red Bryce Young. That's pretty cool. We're not uh, as far as these go. We're not doing bad, but I think overall these are just kind of very little to find in here. Michael Pittman, T.J. Watt, Gasicki. Diggs and Adams, Mike Evans. Oh, oh, geez, there's an auto, and it just snuck right up on us. And it is good grief. And this is the autos you get out of this, guys. You, you get them very rarely, and they're like fifth to eighth rounders. You look him up for me, Cole. Eli Ricks. On the back is uh, Tony Mandarich, giraffe class. Eli Ricks, not numbered. This is, I mean, contenders autos are some of the most sought after in the... In the hobby. He's a free agent. Got drafted. Oh my gosh, he's not even a drafted guy. Goodness, goodness, goodness. All right. So, so far not so good, but we did get an auto at least. We did get an auto. Do y'all know? I, I mean, I'm giving you my honest reaction, guys. I mean, it, it is contenders. We know that this is the kind of stuff you're going to be having in here. So, Jimmy G, DeAndre Hopkins, Christian Watson. Devontae, Jamar Chase. Where's the base rookies is what I want to know. I thought you were going to get one or two in here. Stafford, Kyler Murray. Draft class, Tyree Wilson. I was really hoping to, to try to get some of the base rookies. And not just the inserts. Jalen Waddle, Desmond Ritter, Shaq Leonard. Brock Purdy, Dak Prescott. Same guys we got before. Von Miller. And that is a red Jalen Hurts. It looks like you're only getting a few of these... Uh, Parallels, too, which is a little surprising. Christian Gonzalez and Emmanuel Forbes. 
Nice combo there. And the last pack. Let's see. So at least we did get a couple of the, the good rookie inserts. That's nice to get. Mike Parsons, Ramondre, Josh Jacobs, Derek Henry, Jair Alexander, Hassan Reddick, Joe Burrow, and Hendon Hooker rookie stallions. I do like these. This would be a nice set to put together. I do like those. I'm interested to see what they look like if they do any kind of parallels in the hobby version. That'd be cool. But I just, I don't know. I feel like they need to, they got to do something with this with this product. I mean, I, I don't feel like they really made a solid effort to improve the blasters. These don't feel that different. Um, I mean, we just opened two of them and we didn't get any base rookie at all. So, I don't know. If they're just trying to make them rare, that'd be kind of cool, I guess. But, I don't know. What do you think, Cole? Yeah, I don't know. This is kind of just like a... Can you clear that up some? This is kind of just a basic product, you know? Like, yeah. A little boring. I don't. I just don't think you're chasing anything in here. Yeah, I'm okay with giving it a low rating, honestly. The enclosed mem is not from a game or event. I know you can't, y'all can't read that very well, but not from a game or event. I mean, you're really not chasing much in here. I, I mean, I would even say these are twenty-five dollars a box, and I don't think we paid for one box out of two of these. Your floor just shouldn't be that low. So I, I think we're gonna give it a four to five there. So again. Sometimes we rip this stuff so that you guys don't have to. So enjoy the videos. You can decide for yourself. Um, this is just going to be a very low floor kind of product. It could have some high ceilings, though. Those RPAs could be pretty big if you hit some of the big guys. So if you like it, if you don't like it, let us know. Tell us in the comments. What do you think? If you enjoy the content that we put out, make sure you put a like on the video. Subscribe to the channel so you can come back and see us again. And we're going to keep ripping new products for you so you can get a look at them, guys. Have a great rest of your week and weekend, and we will see you soon.